Hello? In this video, we will be building a road. Road crossing for pedestrians. And traffic lights. Let's start with the road construction. You'll need cyan terracotta, smooth stone slabs, and white concrete powder. Begin by placing five blocks of cyan terracotta side by side, then add one block of white concrete powder, followed by another five blocks of cyan terracotta. At the end, put three smooth stone slabs side by side on one side and three on the other side. Now, extend the road by adding six more blocks to the front. Place three blocks of white concrete powder, and then four blocks of cyan terracotta. If you have world edit, you can mark one end and the other, and use the command forward slash forward slash stack 10 to replicate this pattern. In the middle of the road, add three blocks of white concrete powder, as shown. Next, we'll need iron bars and a pedestrian crossing caution sign. Place the iron bars and put the sign on top. Repeat this on the other side. As you can see, this is the final product. Next, we build a four-way road. We'll need cyan terracotta, white powder concrete, smooth stone slabs, gray powder concrete. Begin similar to step one. Place five blocks of cyan terracotta. one white powder concrete, and five blocks of cyan terracotta. On the sides, put one smooth stone slab. Extend the road by adding six more blocks as in step one.
Mark positions at both ends. Then use forward slash forward slash stack 10. On one end, arrange 7 slabs in a row, followed by 5 blocks of cyan terracotta and 1 powder concrete. Mark both end positions with forward slash forward slash stack 10. At one end, mark the position. At the other end, mark the position by removing a block. Move to the middle and use copy, with a 180 degree rotation then paste. Fill in the cyan terracotta in middle. Fill the ends with white concrete powder. Round the corners. Now, let's build the traffic lights. We'll need polished blackstone brick wall, slabs, and stairs. Place five polished blackstone brick walls in a row. On top, put an upside down stair, and on top of that, another stair. Add four slabs side by side on the end and then two walls.
Repeat this process on three more sides. You can use a debug stick to ensure they look straight, but note that they might appear invisible from certain angles. In the next step, we'll need three heads and an invisible item frame. Attach one invisible item frame to the wall and place a head on top of it. Repeat below. This is what the finished traffic light looks like. Repeat this process on three more sides. <laughs> 